Godspeed to the Speedy Tribe, man. Yo, your girl won't respect you, man, if you ain't on your purpose, man. I'm telling y'all right now. She will not look up to you as the standard of a guy that she want to be with if you're not focusing on the things that's going to keep her there. Now, being on your purpose is something that'll keep a woman interested because they see and respect the man of high morale and nobleness in regards of his divine purpose. If you out here chasing her only without chasing something bigger than her, then she's going to see that you value her over the bigger picture, which in, con well, which in turn which lead will, will lead her to not want to be with you, man. This is why you got to get your priorities straight as men, man. We have to stop prioritizing the wrong things, man. We got to start getting with the program in regards of what's going to attain or attract more things to us like women and, and finances and a better lifestyle for yourself and just overall peace. Because if you try to find peace within somebody else rather than yourself, that person you're trying to find peace in is going to sense that you're trying to be a codependent, right? on their energy and on them, which in turn will turn them off. It will turn them off. So this is why men, man, I see a lot of dudes putting the female first over everything, every time, you know what I'm saying? Not focusing in too much on their goals too much and putting her over everything, putting on a pedestal enough for her to like be like, yo, you know what? I see what you're doing. You valuing me over what is going to keep me here. Women see this. Women might not verbally express that to a guy, but they will show you via action by way of sub-communication. I keep telling you, women communicate sub-communication. They will not really flat out tell you certain things. They'll just show you why they move in the way they move and how they move by way of not even tending to you anymore because you're not tending to your purpose, man. See, it's always one P, then comes the other P. But in order to get that second P, you got to be on your first P, which is your purpose, man. Control your power. Harness yourself as a man, dog. Because a lot of men these days don't even know how, what it's like to be a noble man in regards to having power within themselves. You want to put power in the hands of other people to control you. Because last time I checked, man, whenever you put your power in a woman's hands, she's always going to not know how to use it because she's not you. You're, she's not a man like you. Only men can control a man's power. A man can, can't not control a woman's power. That's why there's yin and yang. There's a yin and yang energy to this whole concept of life. Because she has her power that she got to harness and you have yours that you got to harness. But if you do anything like give your power to her and be powerless, she's going to see that and she's not going to want to be with you. No woman wants a weak man. And if anything, every woman that I ever came across dated up. The old, women, I, for, for as long as I've been living, I've noticed that women only date up because that's what they look for. They look for a higher standard man for them to live up to and to live with or to be around because they need, in their nature, they're biologically set up to be with a man that's going to provide and protect them. If you don't have that protection or provision factor for them, for them to want to be under, they're not going to want to be with you. And they're going to look for somebody else to do that with. You know what I'm saying? This is why you got to focus on your purpose first. You know what I'm saying? And not the, the P too much, the other P too much. Because when you prioritize that over that, you're going to be left with nothing. You're going to be left with nothing but questions on why you couldn't get what you wanted out of that girl instead of getting what you had to get out of that goal that you set for yourself. Don't lose your eyes. Don't lose, don't lose, your, don't lose your focus on what you set out to do. Because you want to follow the law of another woman, man. We all get caught up in that stuff sometimes. We all are human and everything. But I'm just here to remind y'all that you have a bigger task to fulfill rather than just being caught up on another chick and all, all that, all and all that stuff. I'm guilty too, man. I used to do that too. But even now, when you have women around you, you still gotta know in the back of your head that there's a bigger task to fulfill, man. That you still gotta stay focused on what you gotta focus on because then when you lose focus. They're going to see that and then they ain't going to respect you. Now you're going to have two losses. You're going to lose your purpose and you're going to lose the person that you wanted. Come on, man. You, that's, that can be easily avoided by just unplugging from the pleasures with women and other things that come with that. And focus on the grit and the grind and the hard shit. 
know what I'm saying, grinding every single day, trying to map out your next plan and stuff like that for the bigger picture. It's all about the bigger picture, man. So I just wanted to just convey that message to the fellas out there, man, that's going through hard times with their women right now or even with themselves, man, on finding themselves and losing themselves and stuff like that because we all go through it. I'm just here to tell you, man, focus on yourself, man, because if you don't, that person ain't going to want to focus on you. All right? It goes hand in hand. If you focus on yourself, people are going to focus on you. But if you don't focus on yourself, nobody going to care about you. It's the way of the law of the universe. You know what I'm saying? Godspeed, man. Y'all hit me up for the DM. Hit me up on TikTok. Add me on TikTok. Add me on IG. All of that, man. And DM me for consultations and mentorships, man. I got that available for y'all, man. All right? Godspeed.